What is the value of the expression 6 plus 6 multiplied by 3 over 5 minus 3 multiplied by 2? Which option do you think is the correct answer to this question? This expression has tricked a lot of people and made them choose the wrong option. Let's go through the step by step and solve it together. Many people when solving this question, first go straight to the numerator of this fraction and start with the addition between 6 and 6. So, instead of the original expression, they rewrite it as 12 multiplied by 3 over 5 minus 3 times 2. And the next step, they multiply 12 by 3 and simplify this fraction to 36 over 5 minus 3 times 2. Then, they move on to the denominator and start with the subtraction between 5 and 3. So, instead of this expression, they rewrite it as 36 over 2 times 2. And the final step, they perform the multiplication between the 2's and simplify this expression to 36 over 4, which finally gives them the answer 9. Then, without any hesitation, they quickly say that the correct answer to this question is option D. However, that's definitely wrong. Now let me explain a step by step how to solve this expression correctly. To solve this question, we need to follow a rule that is called PENDAS. And this rule, P stands for parentheses, E stands for exponent, M stands for multiplication, D stands for division, A stands for addition, and S stands for subtraction. We should perform these operations exactly in order from top to bottom according to the PEMDAS rule. Okay, first we simplify the numerator of this fraction. As you can see on the screen, in the numerator, we have an addition sign followed by a multiplication sign. We should start with the multiplication between 6 and 3, because according to the PEMDAS rule, multiplication takes priority over addition. So, instead of the original expression, we can write 6 plus 18 over 5 minus 3 times 2. And the next step, we perform the addition between 6 and 18. And instead of this expression, we can write 24 over 5 minus 3 times 2. Then, we move on to the denominator of this fraction. As you can see in the image, in the denominator, first we have a subtraction sign, and then a multiplication sign. We should start with the multiplication between 3 and 2, because multiplication has a higher priority than subtraction. So, this expression simplifies to 24 over 5 minus 6, which further simplifies to 24 over negative 1. And finally, we get the answer negative 24. Therefore, option A. Is the correct answer to this question?